Hey, what's up? Today we have a review of one of the most interesting projectors on the market in 2021. This is a portable projector with Android 9.0 operating system, 2 gigs of RAM, 32 gigs of storage, 5200 milliamp power built-in battery, and many other features. You know, looking ahead, I am very impressed by this device. It has many interesting functions, as well as good projection quality. We will talk about that in this video. But first, let's do unboxing. By the way, I forgot to tell you the name of this projector, but I think you already read it from the title of the video. This is Tomy C900. Now, I want to ask you to hit the like button under this video, and we can start the review. As I already said, Tomy C900 is a portable projector, so the box is not very big. However, the projector inside is two or even three times smaller than this box. We can see main features of the new projector on the box, such as battery, smart OS, super bass, airplane and mirror cast, keystone correction, HDMI. Inside the box we have a user manual and a projector of a white color. By the way, it is also available in black color. And then there is power adapter, remote control, tripod, and HDMI cable. Did you notice this Karen bag? Tomy C900 is a portable projector with a built-in battery, so you can use it anywhere you want. For example, home, office, college, or even outdoor. This bag is very useful to carry its projector. So one of the main features of Tomy C900 projector is the compact size. Its dimensions are only 140 by 75 by 75 mm. The weight is 530 grams. As you can see, I have a white version, but also this projector is available in black color. Which color option do you like more? Write in the comments below. The projector has a Tomy logo, lens and IO receiver on the front. By the way, the manufacturer says that the new projector has a dust-proof design, because uh, there is optical glass protection. The focus wheel is on the left side. On the back we can see power switch, USB port, HDMI port, 3.5mm audio jack, a DC in power connector. There is also air inlet and outlet. The inscription says that uh, they cannot be blocked to avoid device failure. I think it is a good recommendation. On the top of projector we have keypad with following buttons, power on off, ok, return, volume up down, as well as up down left and right arrows. However, you can use a remote control, it has the same buttons as projector itself, but also a very useful mouse button and a keystone correction. The remote control is powered by two 3A batteries. I think you have already noticed many holes on all sides of projector. These are speakers. Actually, Tomy C900 has dual 5 watt speakers. Later in this video, we will check the sound quality. There is also a hole for tripod on the bottom of projector. By the way, this is how Tomy C900 looks like on the tripod. Very good, do you agree? So I like a compact size of projector and how it looks like. However, design is not the most important thing in any projector. So let's look at specifications, functions and projection quality of Tomy C900. You can read the full specifications list of projector on the official website. Tomy C900 has a DLP display type, 100 NC lumens brightness, OS RAM LED lamps, 1000 to 1 contrast, the native resolution of 854 by 480 pixels, the size of projector from 30 to 120 inches, projection distance from 0.2 to 3 meters, automatic and manual keystone correction. Tomy C900 is a smart projector, and it is powered by MediaTek MT9632 processor. It also has 2 gigs of RAM and 32 gigs of internal memory. Perhaps one of the main features of the new projector is Android 9.0 operating system. There is a Google App Store, YouTube, Netflix, and other popular Android apps. I will show you them a little later. Tomy C900 projector supports dual-band Wi-Fi and Bluetooth 5.0. Talking about battery, it has a capacity of 5200 mAh. The battery life on a single charge is about 3 hours. Now we can power on the projector and look at user interface and the main functions of it. Tomy C900 runs on Android operating system, but it has its own user interface. On the main screen we can see AirPlay, MirrorCast and Manual. Then we have AppMarket, YouTube, Netflix and other apps. The projector has some pre-installed applications, such as app 2 TV, Chrome, File Manager, etc. Yes, Android OS provides almost all the functions that most people need. However, you can connect any other device to this projector via HDMI, for example, game console. There are also many options in the settings menu. 
In the network settings, you can connect projector to your home Wi-Fi network. Then we have a graphic settings. Here you can choose the brightness from standard, highlight and energy saving mode, keystone correction, projection, a zoom and video mode. The sound settings menu has sound output, key tone, sound effect and boot sound. In the settings you can also choose the fan speed, high, middle and low. Tomy C900 projector supports many languages such as English, Japanese, French, German, Italian and others. By the way, I want to show you fan screen mirroring function. You can use both Android and iOS smartphones to display the fan screen on projector. Now I want to check the maximum speaker volume and noise level of Tomy C900 projector. You know, this projector is very quiet. I hardly hear the noise. However, the sound volume is very high. The speaker is really powerful. So Tommy C900 projector has only WVGA native resolution, not even 720p. However, let's watch some videos before I say anything about image quality. You know Tommy C900 has a good projection quality. Yes, the small text is not very clear, so probably this projector is not for presentations, but overall the image is good. I like the brightness and colors. You can even use the projector in daytime. I think that the Tommy C900 is a good projector for home and even outdoor cinema.
It has built-in battery and Android OS, so it is a completely standalone device. If you want to buy this projector, I will leave the link in the description under this video. Thank you for watching, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel Tech Brothers.